Good morning, happy Monday. <laughs> I'm filming a little week in my life, I'm pretty sure, because I wanna take you along on what a full week kinda looks like. I'm obviously not gonna show you every little bit of it, but I'm gonna be showing you the majority of what's going on. So, it is Monday, it's already like 10 something, and I had class at 7 a.m. this morning, so my day has already been started a long time ago. But I'm doing some fun stuff, so I wanted to just take you along for the next few days, show you all the fun stuff I'm doing. My plan for the rest of the day is actually pretty exciting. Uh, right now, I'm gonna make some coffee because I'm so exhausted and I was planning on taking a nap, but I don't feel like I have time to take a nap, so I'm just gonna make some decaf coffee or maybe matcha. Oh my gosh, can you see the hair on my legs? Golden retriever life, <laughs> but I'm doing that and then I'm gonna be going to the gym because I'm starting Rocco's growling at himself in the mirror I'm starting a training program with this girl on Instagram so today's our first day of one-on-one -on -one online coaching so I have a workout to do and I'm excited for that it's a leg day so I'm trying to kind of wait until it's not a really busy time at the gym so I'm probably gonna go in like an hour and then after that later tonight we're meeting up with Caitlin Nolan and her boyfriend Hunter for a little double date tonight. So Keiko is gonna be here and we're gonna go get dinner and go bowling tonight. I'm so excited to meet them and meet her. Finally, we've just been talking on Instagram for like quite a while now and she's in San Diego visiting and uh, it's the perfect time. So we're meeting up. She's only here for like a few days, but we definitely wanted to make sure that this happened because we've been talking for a while. So very excited to do that. But that is tonight, like not until like seven-ish tonight. So we've got basically a whole day ahead of us. Let me show you Rocco <laughs> You're silly Rocco. Rocco boy. You're silly. Why are you growling at yourself? This is kind of the plan for the week. This is Julia's weekly planner that she came out with. So cute. Yeah, I've got some homework assignments to do this week. I'm going to SeaWorld on Sunday. I'm getting my hair done actually on Wednesday, which is going to be really fun. So I can't wait to show you that. But yeah, the exhaustion is real. So I need some caffeine in me. I'm probably going to make a matcha because I haven't made a matcha in a while, honestly. And it sounds pretty good. A decaf coffee just does not sound right to me right now. So we're not doing that. This is the cabinet. You're kind of like on my espresso machine, which is why it's kind of a weird position but oh i've also been taking these it's not sponsored but i did work with hilma before and they sent me their elderberry immune support gummies and i've been taking two of these a day so hopefully those are doing something good for my body getting all my matcha stuff out now and i'm excited peak tea matcha sun goddess matcha my go-to i have my califia farms oat barista blend and this is my Starbucks cup. I got this cup from Starbucks. I think I already talked about it in multiple vlogs, but I'm obsessed with it, so I can't stop talking about it. It's like a $10 reusable plastic cup, and it's so cute and so nice. So, are these microwavable? Do not microwave, noted. I'm just gonna use a little mug then. Make sure it's microwave safe. I'm gonna pour a little water in here. Literally just a tiny bit. And then put it in the microwave. Once I have the microwaved water, we get our little matcha sticks and pour it into the hot water and we do this so that it can dissolve better. It says it works in cold water too, but I haven't tried it yet. And I can only imagine that it's way easier to dissolve in hot water. So this is just the way that I've been doing it. So you empty that in there. And then I just take some plain white sugar. And I honestly forget how many scoops of this I did. I thought I did two, and then I realized that it wasn't sweet like I usually do it. So maybe I do four, but it's a fourth a teaspoon. So I'm pretty sure I do four to make it one tablespoon no that's a lot i did three and a half <laughs> and then after that is done take the peak tea matcha whisk and this thing is so nice it's so powerful i had an amazon one but it was not as good as this one I am spraying matcha everywhere. <laughs> so after we have that, I'm actually gonna pour the milk in first. So uh, I filled up my cup with ice. I think I've shown this so many times on my channel before. Actually, I wanna say, because it's so funny. Wait, let me do this first. So pour matcha in over. Cinnamon, this is just from Trader Joe's. I put cinnamon on the top and then I mix it up and drink it. Now that I won't be interrupted anymore, I wanted to say Julia's video of her 
like being me for a day when she came to visit me and I was gone in class all day So she did like a being Lauren Doan for a day in her apartment She made matcha, but she literally mixed like the tiny bit of matcha with like a cup of water instead of doing a little bit of water and then the rest milk and she was like I don't know what this what it is, but it just does not taste good and I was like girl <laughs> I watched the video over once it was done. And I was like you mixed it with water and you're supposed to mix it with milk, that's why. It was just funny. She's like, that makes a lot of sense. As to why it was so gross. But, here's my matcha. Let's taste test it. I got a chunk of something in there. But, it's delicious. Okay, let's see what we have to do next. Okay, I think I'm gonna go pick out a workout outfit now. I got a few new shirts. I showed in my last vlog, like my little weekend vlog, but a bunch of long sleeve shirts for the gym because that's like my favorite go-to thing to wear. So this drawer is so packed. This is one of them. It's just like a regular black long sleeve, a tight cropped long sleeve. So we're gonna wear that and then we're also gonna wear leggings because it's freezing today. We gotta do a comfy pair, you know? So like like Lululemon, I'm guessing. A little blue and black moment, I think. Okay, I'm gonna get changed, see how this looks, and I will let you know. Also, day three, I think, of my spray tan. Okay, this lighting does not do me good. I look super orange, and my face looks super white, which is not the case in person. My face is obviously a little bit lighter than my body, because it's supposed to be. Okay, this is more accurate. I just feel so tan and it's so nice. Okay, here's the gym fit. I love these tops. I'll link them down below. I got like four different ones. Like, I think they were all different brands. So I will link them for you, but they're just so comfy and so flattering to use. And right now it's kind of cold still. So I'm not just going in sports bras. So these are staples. Then I have these leggings. They're just little Align leggings. So comfy. I'm not a cheerleader. I was, but I wasn't a flyer. I was a base. Okay, I just threw on this aloe hat. I definitely want to get more of these because they're super cute. And I always wear hats to the gym. But I'm charging my AirPods right now because every single time I go, they're dead. And I literally brought a portable charger in with me last time and carried it around with my case until they were charged. So I'm not doing that again. So they are charging, but I'm just gonna chill for a little bit. 11:42. I'm gonna try to aim to leave here at 12. And yeah, welcome. Okay, little change of plans. I decided I'm gonna go at one because 12 is pretty still busy. Last time I went, it was really packed at 12. And we're going to right here. But I checked the website. It says that they're not as busy at one. So we're gonna go at one. So we have like an hour now, but I'm just gonna use that time to do some homework because I needed to do it anyways. So I've just been playing with Rocco. A little tug of war with his... Fun fact, this is his first toy ever. And it's held up so well. So... The brand Go Dog, shout out to you, has it ripped. Okay guys, I went to the gym. I also walked around the mall a little bit and I got a pair of jeans. So let me show you those really quickly. They're from Abercrombie. You already know because they have the best jeans. Sorry, I don't know where to put you. Also there's clothes everywhere so don't mind that. But these are the 90 straight ultra high rise curve love, but they have the little slit on the ankle. So they're so cute. And they're this like black, worn vintage black, I guess you can call it, but they're so cute. Love these so much. They're in a size 24 regular. And then I got a green juice from Pressed. And then after that, I came home, showered, because I have an hour to be ready. So I was trying to pick out an outfit for a long time for dinner tonight, because we're going to dinner at this Italian place that I love, and then we're going bowling afterwards. So I'm currently in my bowling outfit, because I'm going to the chiropractor first also, and I don't want to wear boot heels to the chiropractor. So this is what I'm going to change into after dinner, some Converse and jeans. But for dinner, I'm wearing these like white trousers. Oh, they're in the dryer because they're kind of wrinkly. So I have the white trousers and then I also have this jacket that I just got from Urban Outfitters. And it is so soft, you guys, and so comfy, and it's literally so cute, and I'm obsessed with it. So I'm also wearing this tonight. It's, like, very long, like a coat. And, yeah, I feel very comfy. And then I'm wearing, like, these knee-high black leather booties. Fake leather. <laughs> but I'm tucking them under the pants, so they just look like little boots. But that's the deal. I, like I said, I have an hour. I'm also hungry. So there's a pizza in the oven. Well, the oven's preheating for a pizza. But this is my fit now. This bodysuit's from Princess Polly. These jeans are Levi's. And yeah, I'm gonna do my makeup and my hair now. I'm probably gonna just Dyson dry my hair and then I might do like some waves or something. I don't really know yet. And then I need to do makeup, which is hard to do right now since my body is tan and my face is a little lighter than my body. So my makeup doesn't match my skin, but we're gonna have to 
figure it out and deal with it. So let's go start getting ready because I am a mess. Okay, I'm just making this pizza that I got a long time ago. It's just the Target brand spinach and goat cheese pizza. I'm so excited to eat this and it's about to go in, which is good because we have to leave at like 5.15, no, 5.30. And Kiko is still at the gym, but he's coming back soon. Okay, I just finished getting ready. I use the wave wand for my hair so that it's just like wavy crimped. And then did my makeup, simple. And now I'm eating some pizza because we're both starving and need to go. I don't know how I feel about the back of my hair. I don't know, it's kind of like very off. Also, what? Look at this muscle. Wait, that's bone. Buff. I think it looks fine. <laughs> what the heck, what? Say hi to the vlog. Hi vlog. I want to hold your hand. We gotta go. We have time. Okay, we just got done at the chiropractor. It's 6.42 and our reservation's at 7 and we're meeting them there at 7. So we're right on time, which is nice. It was so busy there, so I thought we were gonna be late. But he had such a good time. He keeps talking about how great it was. The massage chair, because we got there early. I had to get my like rescans first to see how I'm improving and stuff. So we did that and then I got adjusted and then he got adjusted. And it took like an hour. We were there for like a little less than an hour. But we're almost there. I'm excited. I'm so hungry. So I'm so excited to eat some pasta. Yum. Caught that on video. You just broke the plant. Oh, you did. Are you excited? I need a pee. I'm so hungry. Eight minutes until our reservation. How adorable is this? <laughs> Crumble. <laughs> We've had crumble in forever. We like I was love. Say, have you had it? Yeah, we, we have yeah. one right by us. Ooh. <laughs> We couldn't choose four, so we got six. <laughs> so there's sugar cookie. All I can smell is the blueberry one. Me too, blueberry muffin. You don't like blueberry? <laughs> I just like blueberry muffins. I, I do like I blueberry muffins. I don't want to ruin it with a blueberry cookie. Chocolate chip, super doodle, <laughs> hazelnut, sea salt, and birthday cake Oreo. I wish they gave fork. Oh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like these ones are bigger than the ones in Arizona. I know. Really? Huge. Which one do you want to try first? And this one first. It looks Good. Oh no! <laughs> Where? Oreo? Mmm. I knew so I was good. gonna like that one. Mm -hmm. That one's really good. That's that like a cake. Good. Yum. It's the best one I've had. The frosting is so good. So good. It's my favorite. Yeah, this one's really my favorite. So good. I love sticker. You guys haven't tried the best one yet. Which one? The hazelnut one. Mm. Well, but it? it's your turn. I like that one. Lauren's first fall. Good morning everyone. It's the next day. It's 9.38 in the morning and I just got to school because I have class today from 10 to 11.45. So I'm here for that. And yeah, last night was so fun. We had so much fun with Caitlin and Hunter. Such a fun double date. We went to dinner and it was so good. We literally talked the whole time and then we went bowling after, which was also so fun. And we got crumble in between too. So we taste tested that and it was delicious as always. Literally haven't had crumble in so long. And if you know, you know, I used to get it so often, like literally every single week. It was so bad. So we stopped doing that. So we both really wanted crumble again. So we got it. So we did that. I'm not crying. My eyes just burning. <laughs> and yeah. They leave tomorrow to go back to Arizona, so we're actually getting lunch with them again today because we wanted to go to this one place called Jake's in Del Mar. And it's such a good place. They have such good pie. It's literally delicious. So we wanted to take them there. So we're doing that at two. So after my class, and then after I go home and 
get all my stuff ready and stuff. Then we'll go at like two. My class is in 20 minutes and I have to go get COVID tested before. So we gotta go. But I also made an iced chai. So yummy, but I'm not allowed to eat or drink anything 30 minutes before my test. So it's kind of just been sitting here and yeah. That's the plan, so let's go. I also got some prime parking today. I was driving around for a little bit, but finally a spot opened up and now I'm here. And look at the ocean view, so pretty. Okay, home from class, getting ready to go. It's 12.51 and our reservation's at two and we're meeting there at two. But we're gonna go kinda early just to walk around and stuff because it's a really nice day and it's kinda hot today even though I'm putting on a jacket and I get cold for no reason. So this is from Cotton On, this bodysuit. I just got a bunch of stuff from Princess Polly that I'll show in a haul soon, but bodysuit, so comfy. And then these jeans I just got yesterday, my Abercrombie, and then my Converse. Oh, he missed. So what we've been doing with Rocco. Go. To get his golf needs out. Well, not really. We are in Del Mar now, so bright. That's coming in. And hot. We're sitting here at this little bench and watching the surfers. Well, he's watching the surfers, per usual. Just got home from meeting up for lunch again. And it was so good. I got a like turkey sandwich that had brie cheese on it and sliced apples and a bunch of other stuff that was so good. And then everyone just had really good food. And then we had pie, so good. It's called their hula pie, so it's like an ice cream pie. Delicious, but obviously we couldn't finish it because we were all stuffed. And we should, all should have just shared one, but we didn't. And then after that, we went to Trader Joe's because we really needed groceries. I'm like out of so much stuff. So I'm gonna give you a little haul of the necessities that I needed. So salmon, the best one, fresh Atlantic salmon. The boneless skinless one, because I like to chop it up. And then boneless skinless thighs, my favorite chicken. I got three sumo oranges because they're the best oranges ever. Zucchini squash, strawberries, brown eggs, oat milk, almond butter because I'm out of, I think everything. We have peanut butter, but we give it to Rocco, so we don't really eat it. Also guys, this cream cheese is my favorite vegan cream cheese ever. If you are someone who only eats dairy-free cream cheese, and uh, you probably have tried many and many are probably really gross. This one is so good. It tastes almost identical to cream cheese and it's the only one that I've ever thought that about. I used to love the Miyoko's one, but this one just tastes almost exactly. So it's so good. And it's cheap too, because it's from Trader Joe's. And then I got three new ginger shots, one of these green juices, Trader Joe's cold pressed juice. Excited to try that. This is what I make my salmon and my chicken and everything in. It's the island soyaki sauce. Really good, easy to marinate stuff with. Then I saw these chocolate hazelnut cruise balls. I've tried the peanut butter and jelly ones before and they're pretty good, but they're like really sweet. So I thought these would be good to try too. They're vegan energy balls and they sound good. So I'm excited. And lastly, bananas. Oh, and then also got some new flowers. So I got these ranunculuses. I don't know how to say that. I think that's what they're called. They're really pretty. And then just some eucalyptus. And Keiko got a bunch of stuff too in this bag. Go, but go. that's all. So I'm gonna put everything away now. And it's 4.30 and we're both exhausted. He's also playing golf with Rocco again. Okay, it's 5.38 now. Kiko has just left and I'm always very sad when he leaves so I just want to lay down and be emotional but we're not going to do that. We're going to distract ourselves. <laughs> so I have a couple packages I want to open up and they're from Steve Madden. I actually opened up a package from them in the last vlog so go watch that one to see some more shoes that they sent me but I have two more pairs that I'm so excited about. Like so excited and I can't believe Steve Madden sent me five pairs of shoes just cause. What is my life? I don't know. I don't know. But I'm so excited about these. So these are the tackle boots. If you know, you know, these boots are so cute. They're pointed toe and adorable. My sister told me to size up. So I did, to an eight, and then usually a seven and a half. 
So I really hope they fit me. We're gonna try them on. Also, don't mind my pants. It's comfy mode. Oh man. Okay, definitely. So happy I sized up because even now they're like kind of tight. Actually, they fit like perfectly. You guys, they're so cute. Can you see them? I'm obsessed. I'm also wearing socks under, so they're kind of a little weirdly fitting right now, but they're so cute, so I got this pair. And like I said, I sized up, so if you're gonna get these, size up at least half size. Then, I love these boots so much, that I got the bone color also. These are the ones my sister has, and she loves them, and I think they're so cute. They're like a little off-white, which is cute, and I only have like bright white boots, so I think these will be cute to match more things, but they're just adorable, you guys. I'm obsessed with like the perfect little booty, their pointed toe. I used to be a hater of pointed toe. Don't ask me why, because I don't know why, but I love them now. So I'll have these linked below. Thank you, Steve Madden, for gifting me these boots that are now my new favorite boots. I'm obsessed with them and I can't wait to wear them literally everywhere. Okay, I don't even know the last time I updated you, but it's 9.38. I've just been so like go, go, go doing absolutely nothing important. I was online shopping for a while. My sister FaceTimed me, or I FaceTimed my sister, and we talked for a little bit, and then my other sister FaceTimed me, and then we talked for a while. And then I was just on my laptop for a while, and then I got ready for bed and washed my face and stuff. And now I have a sumo orange with me because I can't keep myself attentive. I keep getting distracted, focused. I can't keep myself focused. Wow, I need to sleep, but that's the problem. I can't, I need to do homework. I at least have to do this one assignment because I've, it's like the only thing on my list and I just haven't done it in the past like three hours that I've been sitting here, which is a problem. So I'm gonna do this homework. I actually started a new class this week, even though it's like the middle of the semester. So Point Loma has like semester classes obviously, and then they have quarter classes. So there's two quarters in a semester. So if it's a quarter class, it'll either be the first quarter or the second quarter. So it won't start until that time so i'm picking up a quarter class for the second quarter which means my semester is halfway over so i'm starting a new class this week and actually started today so i have an assignment due tomorrow for it around night actually so technically i could do it tomorrow but i need to do it tonight because i'm just already stressing about it and it's a bio class it's called global health and pathogens so i think we learn about like a bunch of global health type of things honestly i don't know i'm taking it for credits because i need more units to graduate so so I could have chosen a simpler one, but I chose to do something like this. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. It's our first assignment, so hopefully it's not that hard. But my sumo orange is the only thing getting me through right now. Also, I guess Rocco too. <laughs> I love you. He was literally sleeping until he heard me peel my orange and then he ran over here. He doesn't even like oranges. He's like scared of them. He'll like jump. He'll get one in his mouth and then he'll spit it out. Okay, do you want a piece? Maybe he'll eat a little piece. I'll give you a little one, okay? Wait, wait, wait. I love you so much. Okay, get it. <laughs> He's so funny. Okay, I need to stop stalling. I'm gonna do homework now. I might update you after, I might not. I might just update you tomorrow. We'll see, but I need to grind, so I'll see you later. Okay, it's 10.22. Just finished my assignment, and I'm logging off because... I am so tired and I have class tomorrow at 7.25 in the morning and I have to teach a lesson tomorrow because that class is all about like teaching physical education and stuff. So we have like short mini lessons that we have to teach to our class. We don't get to teach actual children, unfortunately. So we have to teach our classmates. So we're like in the gym and we're all assigned like a topic or something. So my topic is tossing and catching balls in place. So I have to come up with the whole lesson plan. I'm having to teach that, but I already did it because I was supposed to go on Monday, but we ran out of time, so I'm going tomorrow instead. But that's just another thing that I have to stress about doing tomorrow. But it's 10.23, I'm going to sleep. I will talk to you guys tomorrow, so good night. Good morning, guys. Happy Wednesday. It's 7 a.m. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna be late. I need to leave. I'm going to class. I'll talk to you soon. Heading out, I forgot that I needed to get gas, but I'm pretty sure I can make it to school without getting it. Fingers crossed, guys. I'll see you later. Okay, it is 9.23. I had class and it went pretty well and now I just went to the chiropractor and got my results from my like rescan and they have improved so that's exciting. I just wanna show you. My first scan when I first came in, obviously so messed up. My next scan got a little bit better and then this is my most recent scan and it definitely changed up, so that's good. So now I only have to go two times a week instead of 
three times, so that's exciting. And I'll probably end up going more anyways because I just enjoy going. So I only have to go two times a week, so that's fun. But I need to go get gas because my gas light is on and I'm about to run out of gas. So I need to do that and then I'm going to go home, do some morning things because I did not do anything this morning. Like feed Rocco, haven't taken him out. I don't take him out like before my early, early class because it's just too early and he just goes back to sleep anyways. So yeah, we're going to go get gas and then head home. Hey guys, I'm home. My flowers are so cute. I'm obsessed with them. Like this pop of pink is adorable. But I'm making breakfast right now. I have some eggs, hash browns, and spinach. And I'm just gonna make a little scramble thing. I was gonna make a bagel, but Keiko accidentally took them with him when he left yesterday. So I don't have my bagels with me. But yeah, I'm gonna make a little scramble. I also have a ginger shot that I'm gonna take. I always get like three of these. Oh, I forgot to show you these. When I did my haul yesterday, I realized the Trader Joe's sparkling green tea with pineapple juice. These are probably really good. They sound really good, so I decided to try those, but not right now. I'm actually gonna go to the gym after I eat because it is pole day. So back buys and shoulders, not shoulders, back and buys. Yeah, but I have these ginger shots. So I'm gonna take this while the pan is heating up. Cheers, cheers, cheers. So good. I'm not just saying that, like I actually love ginger. And then I've been taking these Hilma elderberry immune support gummies. I just take two of these. Not only do they taste good, but they have elderberry, vitamin C, and zinc. So perfect, perfect for every day. But let's make some breakfast, I'm so hungry. Okay, this is so random, but I just cracked two eggs in here and the yolk was like bright orange and I've never seen that before, you guys. Like it was bright orange, so I was like, oh gosh, are these bad? Like you can even tell, but it's like kind of orange. So I was kind of freaking out. So I looked it up and it says not to worry because if you spot orange yolk, then you can tell they came from a pure source, which is so cool. So I guess these are good eggs. Pretty good eggs from Trader Joe's. I just thought I would share that because I've never seen an orange yolk before. Usually it's like yellow orange, you know, but this was like orange orange. So yeah, this is my little scramble for today. I'm so excited to eat it. I thought I was out of Cholula sauce and I was out of the bottle. And I found this little packet which comes in like HelloFresh boxes. So shout out to HelloFresh for coming in clutch because I love Cholula, guys. It's my favorite hot sauce. Here's a little breakfast. So yummy. I'm so excited. What are you doing, crazy? Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. <laughs> All right, it is 10.30, just got ready for the gym. This is my fit for the day. I've been wearing long sleeves forever now and it's my favorite. They're just so comfy and I feel confident in them because, you know, they don't show my boobs or anything. But this is from Amazon, so cute. The back looks like this. I showed it in another video, but I love it. And then these shorts are from Abel or AYBL from totally different places, but they look like they go together. So that's good. That is Adidas probably, I don't know where I got it. But yeah, I'm gonna head out now because I need to go and get my workout done because I have to leave here by like 12, no, by like 1.15 to go get my hair done later. So yeah, I don't really know the timing of it all, but I do know that I have to leave because uh, yeah, and I don't feel like going right now, but we're doing it. He has a spike ball. Where did you get the spike ball? Gosh. Come here. Come lay with me. Oh. Lay down. Lay down. Go. I want a hug. Ow. Ow. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I'm back from the gym. I feel so good now. It's 12.19, so I have like less than an hour until I need to leave for my hair appointment. But I'm like so tired and I feel so dirty and gross because my hair hasn't been washed in like three days, which is too long in my books. But I wanted it to become dirty for when they wash it, you know? So I didn't want to wash it right before. Okay, I'm gonna shower, do a little body shower. I'm probably gonna do my makeup too. And then we're gonna head out. I hope they let me like do homework there. Like I'm gonna bring my laptop. So I hope they let me like sit and be on my laptop while they're doing my hair because I'm supposed to be there for like four-ish hours, which I'm not excited for because I have a lot of stuff to do. 
but that's okay. All right, I am fully ready now. A big switch, but I put some dry shampoo in my hair because it's very oily and I know I'm about to get washed, but I couldn't deal with it. I just couldn't. Wearing this bodysuit that's so cute from Princess Polly. I actually need to film Princess Polly videos soon, but look at the back. It's a bodysuit and it's open back and it's so comfy and flattering and cute. And then obviously my Abercrombie jeans and then my black and white AF ones. And then I have this purse right here. It's my Kate Spade purse because it is big enough to hold my laptop in it, which I'm going to bring. So this is the fit. I'm very excited, kind of nervous just because I don't want to be there for almost five hours. So don't know how that's going to work out, but I will update you guys. This is like my first time doing so many things. First time getting a spray tan last week. First time getting my hair done. I'm just doing a lot of things. Mainly for wedding prep though, because I'm doing all this now so I can see if I want to do it for the wedding. So it makes sense, I guess. <laughs> ready for the grand reveal first of all I have a hiccup so sorry if I hiccup in the middle of this clip but guys <gasps> oh yeah there it is guys it's very ashy right now which is obviously gonna wash out as soon as I wash my hair but I kind of like the ashiness obviously it's gonna be more like warm toned and golden once I wash it but I'm obsessed with it so it took like five hours it was almost double as expensive as I expected it to be and they wanted me to come back for a second time because obviously I'm starting from brown hair so going blonde would not be possible in one session so this is what they did in one session but honestly I feel like I'm obsessed with it and I don't even want to go back to get it lighter because this is like the lightest I would want to get it I'm so obsessed look at the back back isn't as light because she wanted to focus more on the front for the first session so if I were to go back I would just do like a few more like low lights or baby lights in the back you know but yeah I'm so in love with it I feel like it's gonna get a lot more golden like it looks very ashy right now and like almost gray I just don't feel like myself and it looks super different in different lightings see like in this light it looks more warm tone I think it's so pretty let me know what you guys think but anyways yeah it is 6 37 now it's so late I was there for so long and I didn't do any work on my laptop because I just didn't want to pull it out and I was just on my phone but I'm about to cook hello fresh because I'm very hungry right now so that's what we're gonna do I already kind of started but then I was like I forgot to update the vlog so here we are with my new hair how do we feel about it please let me know in the comments but if you're gonna be mean don't let me know because it's too late and I can't do anything about it so here is the finished dinner I'm so excited to eat this it looks so good and it was so easy and Rocco just watched me the whole time but I'm gonna eat this and then let you know how it is after okay guys you're on my laptop case and I don't have my tripod so this is what we're working with it's 8 16 I have been stalling this project for so long I have a presentation tomorrow it's like a group presentation we had to basically act out like five to six minutes of a film that we watched for our class which we already did, mm, that's already filmed and whatever, we did that last week, but we have to do the actual PowerPoint, which is a 25 minute presentation, and I do not feel skilled on my topic that I'm presenting about, so we have to sit and grind. We watched the film Pan's Labyrinth, if you've seen it, it's like a really weird old movie. I don't know if it's that old actually. I think it's kind of old, but it's in Spanish. And we have to just talk about the film. My topic is on sound, and I don't know that much about sound. So this is gonna be interesting, but I'm gonna grind and do this presentation. I'm also drinking the Trader Joe's Cold Press green juice. I haven't tried this yet, but it's probably really good. Yeah, tastes like a juice. Tastes like a green juice. <sighs> okay. Time to do this. Okay guys, it is 9.09. I've been working on this PowerPoint for a while. I just practiced my part. This is not my slide. These are my slides, these three. And all the other ones are still being worked on, so I don't feel as bad. Also, what is that? That's just not a pleasant cover photo, but I'm so tired, you guys. And I still need to take Rock out to go potty and all that. But other than that, I'm probably just gonna hop in bed because I'm exhausted. I still have so much to do this week and it's only, no, it's already Wednesday and I still have a lot to do because it is midterms week. And I have an essay due on Friday for my psych class. I have an assignment due tomorrow for my bio class. And then I have some work that I need to do this week too. And it's just a really busy week. But next week is spring break. So I have the whole week off from school, which is gonna be so nice. Nice, not doing anything, but it's gonna be nice. Not have to go to class. Rocco's gonna love it. 
<laughs> Mino having to leave him. Oh, Rocco. Oh, Rocco boy. <laughs> I love you. And I'm going to end the vlog because I'm probably going to start another one soon. Probably tomorrow, honestly. I've been vlogging so much, so make sure you subscribe if you haven't. To see all of the new vlogs and lifestyle content, and wedding content, and clothing hauls, and all that fun stuff. So if you have not subscribed, make sure you do that. And follow me on Instagram, which is just Lauren Doan. TikTok, Lauren Doan with two N's. And all that fun stuff. Make sure you like and comment on this video because I'm responding to all my comments and chatting with you guys. It's my favorite thing to do ever. Ever. I love talking to you guys below so make sure you leave me a comment down below so we can chat and yeah I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys!